Now, singing vowels are also important. We talked about um, the acoustic modes or, or how we do vowels. Um, singing vowels are important because vowels in singing are some somewhat um, synonymous with resonance. So when we say vowels, singing vowels in this presentation or any discussion about vowels and singing, we don't typically mean these vowels at the top. We're not talking about language or linguistic vowels. We're not talking about A, E, I, O, U, and sometimes Y. We're really using the term vowels as a metaphor for sound color or resonance, right? That's an important point that you need to understand, okay? That when we talk about singing vowels, we're not talking about characters on a page in my book, not those vowels. We're talking about sound colors. So this is five language vowels, A, E, I, O, U, and sometimes Y. And I phonated them perfectly. This is five singing vowels. A, A, O, E, A. Okay, those are five singing vowels or sound colors. And when you train the acoustic modes in this course, you're going to you're gonna learn these 10 singing vowels down here. These 10 vowels are the sound colors you're going to plug into the vocal workouts that you're going to be training every day. All right? So you're not just going to be, you know, doing workouts and making some sound and not really understanding what you're doing. No. I'm setting you up for something here. You're going to be smart about your workouts. You're going to be picking an onset and you're going to be picking a vowel or a, a singing vowel or a sound color for a good reason. And the reason you're going to pick any particular singing vowel to train over is all explained in the course. The features, advantages, and benefits of each one of these vowels. These singing vowels manipulate the larynx into different positions. Okay, I'll just give you a little bit of foresight. All right, so if I train that third vowel in from the left, A, for example, it's going to help me dampen my larynx and get resonance to my hard palate, which is going to help me sing better. If I train uh, 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 that second blue vowel in from the right, O, U, uh, 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 if I train that vowel, that's going to help me to narrow my upper vocal tract, which is going to build belt strength and help me amplify my head voice. All right? So like, like learning the features and advantages and the benefits of the onsets, you're going to do the same for the vowels. Um, as a student of this program, you're not going to be a dummy, that's for sure. You're going to understand exactly what's going on, and you're going to understand what a vowel is, you're going to understand what an onset is, and then you're going to learn to put them all together into integrated training routines or customized training routines to fix your unique training issues.